Week 13 of TGC Tours, where once again we have a lovely group of individuals who prove they are better than most everybody else. Well, at least at playing an online video game, which, unless we're in the movie Pixels, really doesn't mean a lot overall. On the PGA Tour, the Hyundai Tournament of Champions was won by The Machine. Big shock there. Ian The Machine Sweeney wins by three strokes. IJS 1543 on the PS4, although he did have two bogeys last week, so maybe the machine is in need of oiling or lubing. I bet he lubes a lot. Just speculation. On the PGA Tour regular round for the other non-winners, Kenny Willis now qualifies for a Tournament of Champions by picking up the win by nine strokes. This guy was stroking it harder and longer than anybody else. On the Xbox One, he is X File This X. Props for a pretty unique name there, Kenbo. Good job. On the European Tour, they were in South Africa for the BMW South African Open. Jack Oliver picked up the win by eight strokes. Yeah, we had some blowout wins this time. It's kind of nice after a few weeks of everything being closed. He is AFCTU Jacko on Steam and PS4. If you would like to jack on your PS4 or Steam, add him. He'd love it. And, you know, such is life in the Web.com Tour. The Sam Crow Charming Challenge won by Steve Williams in a three-way playoff. His PS4 is such underscore underscore is underscore underscore life. Because several other people use such as life, and Steve just had to have it. When you have to have it, you find a way. <laughs> On the uh, CC Tour, now this was one of the four majors for the CC this year. The Chubbs-Peterson Memorial. Matthew Jones winning it on the CCA level. Picked it up by a stroke over Robbie Stone. He is XX, I'm at XX on the Xbox One. On the CCB level tour for our Chubbs Peterson Memorial, the winner of the Wooden Hand was Jan Jansen. I'm saying like he's saying Jan Jansen. Just doesn't quite have the same ring as maybe like Jan Jansen. Three stroke win over Tony Donahue. On Steam, he's stained. Seriously, that's his Steam name. Stained. I don't know, must drink a lot of coffee. On the C-Cube Tour, Chris Heiler picks up the win, and he won by six strokes. So a big win there for Chris Heiler. On Steam, he is Heiler Chris. H-I-L-Y-E-R Chris. Maybe you'd like to add him on Steam, so congrats on the runaway win there, Mr. Heiler. On the CCD level tour for our Chubbs Peterson Memorial, the wooden hand now resides in the men's room of Marco Borghi. Borgi, Borghi, Marco won by six strokes over Polo, and uh, he is Bomar97 on the PS4 if you would like to add Marco. Congratulations there on that uh, big, big win there. On the CCE level tour, we have a three-stroke victory for Victor Romero. Oh, Victor Romero. He is, I don't know if he's like a Latin lover kind of thing, but he is the only guy in double digits under par, 12 under. He is a Vic RMI on the PS4 if you want to add him up. And then on the CCZ level, Joel Vivian picked up the win on CCZ at five over par. Kevin Connor was second at seven over par. They were the only two that were not double digits or more over par. He is JD period Vivian on Steam, JV Freak Body on Xbox One. That's right, he's got a freakishly small body. He's so thin that, you know, he's got to wear shower shoes so he doesn't go down the drain. On the True Sim Tour, the Hyundai Tournament of Champions, ladies and gentlemen, we have the con. Andrew Con Artist was the winner, picking up a four stroke win over Dennis Paisley Pants. He is uh, Andrew's Furzu. On the PS4, it's because he doesn't like zoos with animals without fur. So you would find, like, no hairless dogs at his zoo. And on the True Sim Tour, the BMW South African Open, Ronnie Atkinson 
picked up the win by three strokes over Jesse Young. On Xbox One, he is Ron Ron, but the Ron is a zero, so it's R-Z-O-N-R-U-N, if you like to add them. Congrats to the winners, and next week, if you win, I will make fun of you right here on the Weekly Wrap-Up on TGC Tours.